mer Qu'on voit danser Le long du golfe clair A des reflets d'argent La mer The Texas Coastal Bend is a curvature of land along the Gulf of Mexico that is inhabited by nine counties, Aransas, B, Brooks, Jim Wells, Kennedy, Nueces, Refugio, and San Francisco County. Residing in Nueces County is the largest city along the Coastal Bend, Corpus Christi. Once considered the sparkling city by the sea, recent years has seen that title revoked in retaliation for the trash that can be seen littered across the beaches of Corpus. From the locals, the large array of tourists, or even what gets dragged in from the waterways, the seashores have seen better days. The Coastal Bend is home to many diverse groups of aquatic life, but due to the amount of trash, most of that life is finding it harder to compete for living spaces. Some of the most common items found in waters can take decades or even hundreds of years to break down. Plastic bags, 10 to 50 years. Aluminum cans, 200 years. Cigarette butts, one to five years. Plastic bottles, 450 years. Fishing lines, 500 years. Beverage holders, 400 years. Even with these numbers stated, there's no guarantee that those pollutants will be completely broken down. Withering may continuously occur to the materials due to weather and water corrosion. However, those plastics will only break down into smaller parts, making it easier for not only aquatic life, but creatures such as birds to eat the hard-to-digest microplastics, causing slow, painful deaths to the animals. When microplastics mix with plankton in the environment, small fish detect those plankton and consume both the plastics and the plankton. Larger fish consume those fish and it bioaccumulates to the point there is so much plastic that one commercial fish that we fish off the coast, we consume it and it gets into our systems too. There are billions of pounds of trash and chemicals floating on top of the water surfaces. The impacts of those materials being thrown into the ocean are relentless and can be felt outside the waters. Human health can be affected by water pollution due to it transferring waterborne diseases and carrying chemicals that can cause other degenerative or carcinogenic diseases such as lead and arsenic. Much of the water pollutants make it harder for humans to revisit their nostalgic childhood destinations. Once named after the beautiful scenery, Corpus hopes to make a comeback in the near future. The push to classify plastics as hazardous waste, challenging permits that would help stop chemical runoffs, organizing meetups that clean the beaches, and finding new ways to cut down on plastic are some of the solutions to the plastic problem. Although none of these propositions may be permanent, challenging our problems sooner may help us buy time to enjoy the beaches. Hopefully someday, Corpus Christi can reclaim the city's reputation as being the sparkling city by the sea. Pour la vie.